Hi guys, welcome to this more showcase of the Luma mod for Cocoon, which unlocks the native HDR presentation. As you will see on the left, we'll have the SDR presentation and on the right, the HDR presentation. In my opinion, this kind of indie games with simple art benefits the most from native HDR because the SDR presentation is very clipped and very dull, whereas in HDR you can have the full highlight details completely unlocked with uh, superb highlights, colorful art and so on. So yeah, this game really uh, shines with this mod. The installation of the mod is fairly simple. I'm showing it at the end of the video, as well as the games covered by the mod. The mod is a complete framework for modders. It's not just about adding HDR to games, but you can also use it to add DLSS, super resolution, as well as uh, modern features to the games. For instance, there is a work in progress Final Fantasy VII Remake mod, which will add DLSS. Don't forget to join the HDR Den Discord if you're interested in the other projects. All the links will be in the description below. Vas-y francophone, alors c'est juste une présentation euh, rapide de, euh, du mode Luma pour Cocoon, un petit jeu indé Game Pass qui est très sympathique. Justement, le mode permet d'autant plus en profiter puisqu'on a un gros gain visuel. Et je couvre justement le détail d'installation ainsi que les jeux couverts à la fin de cette vidéo. Comme d'habitude, tous les liens sont en description.
So to install the mod, it's fairly simple. Go into the Reshade homepage and download the latest version with full add-on support. Once it's done, launch the application and select the game of your choice. Since my game is installed through Game Pass, I don't see it here, but I'll just manually add it. Clicking Browse and being in the game folder. So I select the game launch helper.exe. For your game, it could be a different name. Just next. I know it's a DirectX 11 game, something you can find on PC Gaming Weekly, for example. Next, you don't need any shader here, but I installed the Lilium shaders to make sure it works in game. You don't have to, it's not mandatory. You can just go and click on next. For the add-ons, just click on next and you're done. The second part is going to the GitHub page of the mod, get to the latest version and click on show all 42 assets. So you have all the games covered here by the mod and mine is for the Unity engine. It's this one for Cocoon. Could be a different one for uh, each game, so make sure you download the right one. Once it's done, just extract it, copy all the files and paste, paste them into the game folder. Make sure it's where the dxgy.dll is. It means you, have, you are in the right folder for the, for the game. And you're done. You, should, you can launch the game and start playing, it will work by default. By opening the reshade uh, menu, you can adjust the peak brightness slider, the UI slider, and as well the paper white, and many more stuff if you, if you need to. And uh, it should, by default, take your system value calibration. That's it for me. Thanks for tuning in, and see you next time.